Uh, so Kyle Bain got some. Yeah, yeah, we uh, were a little beat up across the board at some spots, and so Kyle got a little receiver and and uh, you know did some good things. So you know he's a good athlete and, and the guy that we thought uh, we might stick him out there and see what he could do. Austin got a little bit of running uh, reps at running back and at receiver as well. So we're just a little bit banged up. We've kind of had some freak injuries here recently, and um, you know we need needed some bodies. How are uh, Joel Willis and Griffin Piat look like they were on the show? Uh, yeah, uh, both of them probably out the remainder of the spring. I'm not quite sure. Griffin, we're waiting to get an MRI back. Uh, and Joel is going to have surgery, I think, Friday. And he's going to have a screw put into his foot. So he's got a broken foot, but it's probably about a month long injury. Speaking of feet, how close is Jason Gibson to being a full go? He's he's close. I mean, he's been he's been working through it. The thing I've liked about Jason is he's been been out here and and uh, competing every day and, and pushing through it. And you know, I, I know he's been bothered and uh, hasn't been completely full speed, but but he's done a good job of, of battling and working through it. Was Lucas just under the weather today? Or yeah, yeah, he just was uh, sick. But he, he was still getting in there just to Yeah, he got in there for some of the walkthrough <laughs> stuff, yeah. Yeah, we needed him there just uh, to identify some situations and walk through some things. And so he was out here, I think. Uh, but I would expect him to be practicing probably Friday, if I was guessing. What's uh, Kyrie still dealing with a little bit of a hamstring? Yeah, yeah. Should, you know, kind of day-to-day -day with him. Maybe maybe Friday, maybe Saturday. It seemed like situation to situation, too. Like some things he was able to do. And... Yeah, yeah. I think it was just, um, you know, we're going to try to get him loose and kind of see what he can do. We don't want to. First thing we don't want to do is make it into a, a major injury because it's a pretty minor deal right now. Look like they also took direct snaps, uh, at least kind of a, sort of a wildcat-ish look as a kind of a big bone package on the goal line. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, you know, we'll be creative. I mean, we're still trying to decide, you know, see what those guys can do from a running standpoint. And, uh, you know, and if they're good runners, if him and Hinder are, can run a little bit, they're the two guys that, that, you know, have a background doing that and they come to mind. And so... Um, you know, we'll put them in, see what they can do, and if it's worth uh, worth doing, then we'll we'll play around with it. Is that ever something we might see in a game in terms of uh, any of the quarterbacks at you know, wide yeah, receiver yeah, positions? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something we've had to do in the past. Actually, Colby Cameron, our quarterback at Louisiana Tech, played a lot of receiver as a junior. Mm -hmm. uh, just kind of ran out of bodies at times, and he came and filled in. And, and so, you know, these guys are good athletes, and so uh, we're going to try to try to figure out a place for them. All right. All I got. All right. Easy. Thanks, yeah. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Coach. Okay. Y'all be good.